بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ان ٹوڈے ویڈیو سیشن وی آر گوئنگ ٹو سال این ایکسرسائز پرابلم دیٹ اس 3.2 فرام بک فنڈمنٹل آف الیکٹرک سرکٹ این دی پرابلم اس فور دی سرکٹ این فیگر 3.51 این بک اپٹین وی ون این وی ٹو سو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو فائنڈ وی ون این وی ٹو این دیس پرٹیکلر سرکٹ so first we need to define uh, we need to assign uh, current let's suppose i1 i2 i4 it's up to you it it can be i3 i4 you know this one i3 similarly i6 i6 and this one is i5 so uh, we have two nodes v1 and v2 as we already know about how to find uh, nodes in a particular circuit so uh nor is any interconnection of uh, two branches so this one is not this one we don't have any other node and we can consider consider this node as a v3 the ground node which is already zero uh so we can apply uh, apply kcl at node v1 as we know uh, all the currents uh, the algebraic sum of all the currents entering or leaving to a particular node is equal to zero so all the currents are basically leaving we don't have we don't have any current enter into this particular node so that would be equal to i1 plus i2 plus i3 plus i4 equal to 0 as we know i3 is equal to 6 so we can put i3 6 and this one is i4 and i2 plus i1 and we can also write that i1 plus i2 plus i4 equal to minus 6 so what is i1 how can we find i1 i1 is basically v1 minus v3 that is 0 divided by 10 through on now we can find so v1 is we can simply say i1 is basically v1 divided by 10 plus i2 is i2 i2 is v1 minus 0 divided by 5 so we can say v1 divided by 5 plus i4 is v1 and this one is minus v2 divided by 2 zero that's why we only write v1 so v1 minus v2 divided by 2 equal to minus 6 so you can take lcm 10 as a lcm minus 6 and this one v1 plus 2v1 plus 5v1 minus 5v2 so after simplifying and cross multiplication r so v1 minus so, so v1 plus 2v1 plus 5v1 that is basically we can write 8v1 minus 5v2 equal to and minus 60 cross multiplying with 10 with minus 6 
So uh, this is the equation A. Now applying KCL at node V2. So KCL at node V2. So I5, I4, I6. Uh, we basically have uh, four current. This one is I3. So I3 entering, I6 is entering, and I4 entering. Uh, so we can write I3 plus I4 plus I6 equal to I5. I5 leaving this particular node. So these three are entering. We know I6 is 3 and I3 is basically 6. So I6 and I3. So we can simply write 6 plus I4 and we know I6 is 3 equal to I5 or we can say 9 6 plus 9 plus I4 equal to I5 or 9 plus I4 how can we determine I4 I4 is V1 minus V2 divided by 2 we already know V1 minus V2 divided by 2 V1 minus V2 divided by 2 equal to and I5 is V1 minus 0 divided by 4 so V2 divided by sorry V2 divided by 4 and you can also write it V1 minus V2 divided by 2 minus V2 divided by 4 equal to minus 9 this one okay now simply rewrite this equation here V1 minus V2 divided by 2 minus V2 divided by 4 equal to minus 9. So taking 4 as the LCM and we can simply write 2V1 minus 2V2 minus V2 equal to minus 9 or 2v1 and we so 2v1 minus 3v2 cross multiplying force so of minus 36 equation b now we have two equation first one is 8v1 minus 5v2 equal to minus 60 equation a and you can write a 2v1 minus 3v2 is equal to minus 36 this is equation b you can multiply 4 with this uh, uh, we can say times minus 4 basically you can multiply minus 4 with this uh, but also So again, 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 8v1 minus 5v2 equal to minus 6 and minus 4 multiplied so minus 8v1 minus 12v2. So minus 4 multiplied so this will become uh, 12v2 equal to and minus 4 times minus 36 would be 144. So you can cross this one and you can simply get 7v2 equal to 84 or we can say 84 divided by 7 and 12 volt so v2 is 12 volt so after putting v2 in any of these two equations you can get value for you can so put this one in equation a 
uh, our equation b so 2v1 minus 3 and v2 is 12 basically equal to minus 36 so after simplifying this one 2v1 minus uh, 36 equal to minus 36 or 2v1 equal to minus 36 plus 36 so v1 equal to 0 so v1 is equal to 0 and v2 is equal to uh, 12 volt so you can easily determine the value of v1 and v2 using nodal analysis Thank you.